There is a big difference between working hard and working smart. Try to look at some examples seen in the real world. Do you not think that cooks and dishwashers work hard? Do you also not think the same of construction workers, bulldozer operators and delivery boys? Yes, the work they do is physical and it can be really tiring. But ask yourself again, how many of them actually live a luxurious life in return for their hard work? Well, yes, they're making ends meet and they're paying their utility bills on time. But do they compare to executives, managers and CEOs? Now this brings you to the next classes of workers, and when observing them you cannot help but think that the big guns of international conglomerates and big companies are living a life of ease, yeah, right? They seem to have everything from the latest gadgets to the most luxurious car models. So why is it that there's such a huge gap in the financial standing of these two groups of people? The answer is how they work, and this spells the difference between working hard and working smart. OK, going back to the construction workers, bus drivers, delivery boys and cooks. Now, they're simply just doing a preset series of tasks. They're not making decisions, they're simply working hard. After all, no matter what the weather is, whether the economy goes up or down, the procedure of mopping, cooking, digging or delivering will have little changes. It's a physically tiring job that requires little decision making or smart thinking. On the other hand, CEOs, managers and executives are always making complex decisions. They're doing deals, they're finding new ideas for profit and so on. Simply put, their work involves working smart, not working hard. In internet marketing, this is the most ideal way of working. In fact, it should be the only way that you do things. Working hard in internet marketing will not yield you cash or income. What will make you earn is working smart. For example, it won't matter how many long hours you stay on your computer working hard to put up your site, adding contents or any other tasks. Even if you tie yourself down doing all this, you're not going to earn any cash. Instead, you have to do things in a smart way, and this is the only way that your internet business will boom. Now, to better illustrate how working hard will not yield you cash in internet marketing unless you do it in a smart way, you should learn more about the misconceptions in the relationship between work and pay. And pay is not the result of work. Alright, before you stop this video thinking just how redundant and unrealistic this statement is, give it some time and you'll learn just how truthful it is. In the real world, work equates to pay, but in internet marketing, it's quite the reverse. Now, this may be hard to digest for now, but you'll soon understand the concept. The idea is that in internet marketing, doing work will keep you from getting profit opportunities and stop you from earning cash. Now, first you should understand why people think that work is equal to pay. Now, Try looking back at your past. When you were a kid, uh, did you try to do jobs for a neighbour like cleaning the yard or clearing weeds or watering the plants? And did you profit a few dollars from doing that? Most likely you did. And with this example, it appears certain that work is what results in pay. And moving forward a few years, when you're in high school, did you try doing some part-time jobs, you know, maybe in a shop or you worked in a fast food restaurant or a cashier in a supermarket? And did you earn some money from those endeavours? Again, it seems so certain that work is what rakes in cash. And then after you graduated from college and got a degree, perhaps you worked for some company and did auditing, filing of documents, serving coffee and organizing schedules for your boss and other, you know, other tasks that are similar to that. Again, these kind of works do yield income and if you're lucky, the income may be good as well. Now ask yourself, were you ever the one who made the decisions? Well. Regular crews also have to make some decisions. 
but the people who make the decisions that really matter are the bosses, the managers and the owners. All you're doing is working hard. The ones doing the smart jobs are the higher-ups and they hired you so that they can focus on making decisions and finding profitable deals while leaving the hard task to you. And this is why work is a hindrance in profiting from your internet business. Now think about the job that's done by your boss in your employment. He does the smart work like decision making and dealings while you do the other tasks like receiving calls, organizing schedules and so on. In internet marketing you are your own boss so this time around you're the one that will be making the important decisions and actions. You'll look for clients, you'll deal with them, you'll win their favor and you will grab the profit opportunities. And in the same way that bosses, managers and executives in the offline world do not want to waste their time doing the menial jobs, this will also be true for you. You see, if you focus on menial works, then you'll lose time on the most important things. In this sense, working is a hindrance to successful internet marketing. This work refers to menial tasks. However, this is not to say that internet marketing will be successful without the menial tasks. If nobody does those tasks, the business will surely crumble and fail. Yes, they need to be done, but it will not be you who will do them. So who will do these things for you? Recall how managers, executives and bosses escape having to do the menial tasks. Yes, they hire employees. And that's exactly what you're going to do, well, in a sense. I'll talk about how you do that in the next video.